Let's see some more properties related to work. Work is a scalar, that means it has no direction. And work is a process of energy transfer, that means it cannot be stored. That's why we give a special name for it called work. If the applied force and the displacement are not along the same direction, then only the component of force parallel to the displacement is effective for doing work. So in the following figures, you can see that the force is not horizontal while the displacement is horizontal. So we had to break it into components and we just focus on the horizontal component which is the f cosine theta. So our work here is w equals to f cosine theta times s. Let's consider this example. You can see the figure there is someone pushing the small trolley with an angle 30 as shown in the diagram. So if we want to find the work done on the trolley after this move for 15 meter. We have to break the force into components and here we just focus on the horizontal components because the displacement is horizontal. So that the work done can be found by W equals to Fs and F here is just the Fx, the horizontal one. So it's 20 cosine 30 times 15. This is the way for us to find the work done.